Sri Lanka has been seeing many governments, as I said at the beginning. Uh, there have been single-party governments, there have been uh, two-party governments, there have been broad coalitions, and none of them seems to have really worked in Sri Lanka. Now, uh, we have a form of a coalition. I don't know what we can really call it. But um, moving forward, the SJB, what's the plan like? Is it a single party government? Is it a coalition? Now, speaking of the JJB and the SJB and, and how people are you know, looking at an alternative other than the current, uh, uh, current well, people in power, um, is there also talks of an alliance between the two? What kind of uh, future so, are, you, are mm, you looking at? Now, the government, government is like, it's, uh, it's like a raped government. Right, you know, it's unfortunately, <coughs> uh, it's a government without a mandate. Mm. It's a president without a mandate. Mm. It's a president who couldn't win the parliamentary seat, mm. who had come in parliament, come to the parliament through the national list, mm. and he was backed by his opposition mm. to be the president. So mm. it's it's completely confused. Uh, uh, mm. Uh, um, parliament and a head of state. Mm. So what, what I proposed, what the SJB is proposing is today. Actually, it's a it's a personal uh, proposal that I gave today. Mm. Uh, I we I believe that we need a fresh mandate. Mm. We need a, a fresh mandate and and a new parliament mm. and a new head of the state. Mm. For that, the best thing that we can do is mm. have a election. Mm. I propose that we should have the presidential election and the parliamentary election on the same very day. Together. Together. So we the can people have can clearly two, choose. Yeah, we can have two ballot papers. Mm. It will save billions of rupees. Mm. It will save billions of rupees. Mm. And also it will save time, money, <coughs> both. Mm. And it it's an ideal uh, way of getting mm. a fresh a leader mm. for the country with mm. a fresh mandate and a parliament with a fresh mandate. And, and, and a clear future for Sri Lanka because people will be able to properly decide at one point of time where is Sri Lanka going to go, who are we going to allow to lead Sri Lanka into this future that we all pray and that we all hope for and that we all want.